happening now. One of the longest running community celebrations in the area is back after a year off because of COVID. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal is live at the Webster Groves Lions Club Carnival and Barbecue. And Jeff, this event is more than just about a good time. They raise a lot of money for a lot of different good causes, Mandy. You are right about that. And uh, the weather perfect tonight as they bring this carnival back after being uh, out last year because of COVID. This now being held on the campus of Eden Seminary. Perfect weather tonight. Uh, had to have it here this year because of construction at the middle school. The carnival atmosphere is back and organizers are thrilled. We have barbecue, we have beer, we have soda, we have funnel cakes, we have popcorn and snow cones and just anything that you can imagine carnival ride wise we have. The Lions Club has hosted the celebration for decades and is partnering with Eden Seminary to bring back the celebration after a year off because of COVID. Oh, you know, it's a little bit of normalcy and it's so nice to see the community back together and enjoying you know, what makes us Webster. The event is also a vehicle for the Lions Club to fund several charities. The Lions main focus is trying to eradicate blindness. So Helen Keller founded the Lions and she wanted us to be Knights of the Blind and we've carried out that mission for years. Some of the longtime barbecue grillers say it's exhausting work, but worth every ounce of energy they spend making the event a success. It's, it's helping the community. We just miss all the camaraderie and all the interaction with people and Man, it's just great to see people again. The rides are really fun this year. The company behind all of these rides was really looking forward to last year. Our family business was started in 1970 and 2020 was going to be our 50th anniversary. And I don't think we could have picked a worse time to uh, <laughs> try to celebrate a 50th anniversary. Organizers are thankful for good weather and the opportunity to bring this tradition back to Webster Groves. And so tonight, uh, this lasts until 11 p.m. Tonight and tomorrow, 5 p.m. till 11 p.m., they sell wristbands uh, these two nights for the rides. Then on Saturday, it is from 11 a.m. till 11 p.m. Sunday, 1 p.m. till 11 p.m., and they will sell tickets for rides. But again, the weather uh, looks perfect for the next four nights for this celebration to return. Reporting live from Webster Grove, Jeff Berthal, Fox 2 News.